What's up guys? Welcome back to another sweet reaction. It is your boy Sweet and who am I reacting to today? Well, you know what? It's going to be some this going to be a little bit personal. Y'all going to be alone with me and that is the segue to who I'm reacting to. Hopson song is called Alone with Me. This song is dope. The video is dope. You're going to see. I, I promise you, you ain't going to be disappointed. Hobson at it again. And without further ado. We going to jump into this one, y'all. It is Hobson along with me. Marcus fucking Hobson, my guy, what up? Don't mean to intervene. How are things going? Talk to me. How you living, G? You look so confused right now. Do you remember me? Cause I've been with you since a teen, fucking you up mentally. I love it. Dude. Staying inside your head with a rent is free. I'm just here to make sure you keep all your crazy tendencies. Look at yourself in disbelief, struggle with your identity. Stuck in depression until you diagnose with it clinically. How's your love life? It's still a trifling mess. Uh -oh. Nigga, you 35. You haven't found a wife yet? I mean, if I was you, would I be stressed? Why ES? I Yes, a mail order bride is nice. It might be best. So <laughs> Dang, bro. Hobson taking some shots at himself, bro. He's got some internal struggles on that one. How did you manage to get rich yet be so empty? Constantly stuck in a deep old frenzy. Maybe your ego ain't eco-friendly. Bro, you got a life that we don't envy. And I bet suicide must be so tempting. Do it. Wait, hold up. Damn. Fuck's wrong with me. I can't leave me alone with me. I'm like, who is this nigga? I'm the one I feel. Dang, you know I love the camera angle on there. It kind of reminded me a little bit of the NF story one. Just like kind of like just how the angle or the camera was like moving was really cool. It was really dope. Just kind of like this, like. It's kind of like this inner self of him and kind of like that devil on the shoulder. He's just like popping. He's like, it's like he's telling him all these things that he don't want to hear just to break. Bro, it's like those internal battles that we have within ourselves, bro. I like the whole concept of what he's doing here. So how's the rap life? Do people enjoy your music? Or are you still spitting that bullshit to destroy the youth with? Be honest, you live in the shadow with Joy and Lucas. Uh -oh. You jealous? <laughs> I know that you are, my point is proof. What the fuck happened to you? You were spitting so cold. You was the ill mind I hops on the list with the ghosts. Then you fell off. You should have took a different approach. Uh -huh. I hate to say it, but you'll never be like Kendrick or Cole, nigga. Damn. It's fucked up. That isn't fair, Marcus. I'm hoping that God will answer your prayers, Marcus. But even if he does, the chances are rare that you have hands in the air headlining Madison Square Garden. Sorry. Nigga, put the mic down. Don't you fight this fight. Cause you the corny rapper only weird white kids like. So every time the blogs post you, the Thomas gon' roast you. I would rather be dead than be caught living in your shoes. Wait, hold up. I'm tripping. Fuck's wrong with me. I can't leave me alone with me. I'm like, who is this nigga? Why do I feel it? It couldn't be good. And then inside the mirror. Wait, hold up. Please stop. It's got control of me. I don't know who I'm supposed to be. I'm like, who is this nigga? Why do I feel it? It couldn't be clear. And then inside the mirror. Alright, I got an idea. I'll tell you how. Man, just like the little battle rap with them and stuff, bro. Just the whole concept of this thing is like on a whole other level, bro. That works. It's gonna sound a little outrageous, but hear me out first. You turn your phone off for two weeks and start an outburst of worried family members, which leads to a local town search. But when they find you, you dead inside of your crib with a letter that says goodbye to your kid. <laughs> but you don't get to see him anyway, cause your ex is wild and shit. So when it's little head, it's like you already died. It's a trip. While you reside in heaven or hell, whichever side that it is, your baby mom's a regret the shit she never tried to get fixed. If you're alive, chances are she'll never try. Try to repent. I'm just trying to show you ways to exercise your revenge. All you want is love, right? Well, you gonna have to get some balls. Shoot your fucking brains out until they splat against the. Okay, so know what? That part right there. That part right there. It kind of reminds me of the mask, right? When he pulls out like the like the like rubber guns and stuff like that, and he's just that's what it, it's just like so loony and just so like goofy, bro. <laughs> that's that's exactly what that reminded me of. To be honest, bro. 
walls. I mean, it has to hit the blogs, and all your fans are getting involved, and you'll be missed, because people don't know what they have until it's lost. Hug your daddy, kiss your mom before this transition is done into the new life. Your current one is trash, it isn't fun. Yeah, everybody got problems, and we all fighting this big war, but your problems are different. You got nothing to live for. Hey, hold up. Oh, no. Fuck's wrong with me. I can't leave me alone with me. I'm like, who is this nigga? Why do I feel it? It couldn't be clear. The man inside the mirror. Hold up, please stop. Just got control of me. I don't know who I'm supposed to be. I'm like, who is this nigga? And why do I feel it? It couldn't be clearer. The man inside the mirror. What I'm thinking, what you're thinking is not the important thing. We are alive right now. That is the important thing. It is important that you focus on this fundamental sense of aliveness within you. And then you will see there is a natural distance between you and your thought process. Once you create a little space between you and your mind, between you and your body, this is the end of suffering. Don't identify any thought as negative because it's just a thought. Who told you it's negative? It's just a thought. You're making it up, maybe you like it. What's the problem? If you understand it's just a thought, it has no power. If you think it's a reality, then it destroys you. That was an ending, bro. He's like, you know what? I, I'm done. I'm done listening to this other stuff. Like, I'm done with it. That is so good, bro. And if you are a fan of Hobson, I, shoot, I'm a huge fan of Hobson, too. And know what? Without further ado, I'm going to have to bid you adieu. And until next time, if you ain't subscribed yet, subscribe to And until next time, salute. If you made it to the end of this video, I appreciate you so much, more than you ever know. So, Crayon Rocket, our motto is be unique, be creative, be you. Why is this important? Because we were all created in the image of God. We were all perfectly and wonderfully made. So, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Share it, like it, subscribe. I would appreciate it. God bless.